What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm racing home because I got some parts. Hopefully they're still there waiting at the door. Uh, hopefully we haven't been a victim of this uh, scumbag truck following monsters that steal packages. So I'm gonna see what we got. Hopefully it's there. Let's see if I'm gonna be a victim today. Let's see what's going on here, man. Let's see. Oh shit, I don't see nothing in front of the door. Oh, hey, I got a, I got a, a legit FedEx guy. He hooked it up. That's what I'm talking about. I was going to leave instructions for him to leave it right there, but hey, he's Yeah, Danny, we we got it. It's here. Awesome. Okay, one piece to the puzzle, man. Ooh, yeah, it's got some weight to it. Son of a bitch. I didn't want it to be that heavy. Alright, well, let me call you back because I'm going to go get our lunch. Alright. Alright, brother, let's jump in. Okay. Right. Later. Later. Alright, let's see what's going on in here. Alright, so find me. Go ahead and uh, talk about what came in the mail for the car. So, if you guys need a hint, it's from Steeda. So right now I have a Steeda X-pipe on the car. I've decided to go the route of, you guessed it, the H-pipe. So let's take a look at it, see what's going on. Just like the other, the X pipe comes in a yellow bag, protect the, the finish on it. I can't remember what the X pipe weighs, but I'm almost certain this feels heavier. So, inside the bag, we've got the Steeda H pipe for the 18 and up Mustang GT. Again, really superior looking work on the the finish of the pipe here and the the uh, definitely the welding is top notch again uh, here you got the Steeda Sidewinder logo it helps brace between the pipes here the high quality exhaust clamps stainless steel finish um, like I said I think it's a little heavier than the X pipe I can't remember I mean just by feel and this is hopefully going to be the sound I'm looking for. Kind of give the car a deeper tone, not only at idle, but during acceleration and kind of cut back on some of the rasp. Now, typically with a, an X pipe versus H pipe is obviously the sound deeper for the H, more raspy for the X. However, the differences in horsepower come down to, I, I think it's probably five to 10 horsepower on the top end, the H pipe will be down just a tiny bit on power in the top end, but should gain a little bit of torque on the lower end. So we'll see how it goes. Um, again, 510 horsepower, not a big deal. For that kind of difference, I definitely would go for the sound that you're looking for over the, the minimal horsepower differences here. So I'm gonna go run the car one more time so you guys can hear a comparison of what it is before. And then I'm gonna install this and you'll be able to come along for the installation. I'll go ahead and show you how it's done. It should be fairly easy, uh, being that the X-Pipe's already in there. But uh, 
and then we'll go out and shoot the after video with the H pipe and see what the difference is and I'll give you my overall impressions. Also in the box, your instructions for all the tools you're going to need and how to cut the pipe or cut your, your existing resonator out. Um, again, I'll cover what I can because it's already uh, got the X pipe on there so it's going to be fairly easy. So I'll see you guys when we get back uh, and we'll see what happens, how it sounds. Thanks. So I'm mocking up the H pipe here. Unfortunately, it's not going to happen today because even if I did have a lift and more room to work with, H pipe is shorter than the X pipe. Uh, so I'm going to have to take it into a, a muffler shop, hopefully sometime this week, and get it up on their lift. Something they can add. Pipe. Um, if I had to guess, it's it's a good five to six inches short of of uh, what it needs.
So that's where we're at. It's, it's the project is stalled out for now. I need to have somebody weld in some pipe. So if you're if you're gonna do it one way or the other, start with the H pipe. If you change your mind on the way the car sounds and you plan on running an H pipe, uh, an X pipe after, that's the way to do it. So to avoid this situation, because the X pipe is longer than the H pipe, but it's better to cut than to add. Yeah, it's, it's, it would have been better if I went with the H pipe, but then I wouldn't, uh, obviously probably wouldn't even be changing the, the mid pipe out, but the X pipe is excellent. It sounds great. It's just I'm trying to get some, uh, some deeper tone out of it. You just change up the sound a little bit. I've, been, I've had raspy S550s for a couple of years now. Uh, the last one is uh, had the Corsa Extreme. So it's loud, but I think Steeda has a really refined sound and, and a nice tone to it. So yeah, Cosmic.